what's going on you guys welcome back to my channel it's me leah lee and i'm happy to be giving y'all another video especially on this topic because to my ladies and to myself this is very real and it's very important you know what i'm saying it's just stuff that we be going through so we need to help sometimes before we get into this video i want you to subscribe to my channel let's go ahead and do that first and foremost if you are not subscribed okay because I'm trying to get to a hundred thousand subscribers okay okay do not forget to turn on your notifications afterwards comment down below if this video helped you out or if I missed anything and for my fellas thank you for hanging in there and watching these videos and being a proud supporter thank you guys so with all the technical stuff being said already let's go ahead and jump into this video this video is ways to make your period cramps go away or not even come at all. Myself, personally, I have very, very bad cramps throughout the entire process of my cycle and even days before my cycle. Sometimes like a whole seven days before my cycle even comes on, I feel period cramps coming on. And that is just the most disturbing depressing feeling ever to know that that is coming and to know before it even comes on i have a reminder the very first thing that i use when i have period cramps or pre-cycle cramps i use pain medicine i use pain medicine honey let's let's go ahead and put that out there that is the number one option <laughs> For everyone, I think um, that is automatically what my brain goes to I'm registered that way just because my cycle is so bad. I truly cannot go without um, taking some type of medicine if I have like a busy day ahead of myself or I have to go to work or I have to just be productive in some way. I have to take medicine even if I want to get some sleep. I need to take some type of pain reliever to even be able to function. So that's what I take. Number two, I use a heating pad. Um, I know some people can use pad, like heating pads where you can actually pour warm water into them like the old fashioned ones with the little screw on top or you can use an electric heating pad that you actually plug into the wall and set whatever temperature you want it to go on whether it's like warm, like a higher level than that, higher level than that or if it gets like extremely hot. So I know my heating pad has four levels on it. I'm going to show it to y'all. This is Old Faithful. And this is not even mine. It's mine now because I've had it for so long. But if she ever wanted it back, she could have it. One of my best friends actually lent me this heating pad because she knows that I have such bad cramps. And um, this one actually has four levels. It's on warm, low, medium, or high. So, and this is actually from Walgreens, and it has an auto turn off after two hours. If the medicine doesn't help and you need something warm to press onto your stomach or on your lower back while you're laying down or watching TV or doing whatever you're doing, get a heating pad, you guys. It will work. It will work. It will work. The only downside to the heating pads is during my cycle, my body temperature is very, very warm, and I feel warm, so the heating pad maybe can make me a lot hotter than what I want to be but it has one job and one job only to get rid of the cramps and it does that exercising I mentioned this tip in the ways to shorten your period video if you have not watched that video it will be down in the description and it should be popping up right here or right here somewhere on the top corner exercising helps with everything to help your body function correctly release the bad stuff out of your body through sweat it helps with lessening the period cramps and sometimes uh, canceling them out a hundred percent I also mentioned birth control and how to shorten your periods but dealing with period cramps birth control can cancel them out completely or lessen them depending on which birth control you get on whether it's a non-hormonal or hormonal birth control having a warm shower or warm bath some people tend to go towards a warm bath but i just don't even like the idea of having a bath while i'm on my cycle um i prefer taking a shower that also helps me with my cramps when i'm going through that difficult time of the month every month it helps showers and baths help having a warm drink helps me also having a warm drink as far as 
having like a warm tea or warm like broth or even drinking warm water i know some people drink warm water with maybe like a hint of lemon or whatever that you want to spice it up just so it's not plain water i drink warm tea a lot so it helps with the period cramps just because anything warm helps soften them it helps them just go away somehow or just be helping like oh my god i'll be dying and then it'd be like helping me come back to life you know what i'm saying i know what y'all know what i'm saying drink some warm drink okay some warm drink that's all you need warmness warm shower warm heating pad warm drink you get the you get it you get it <laughs> And this last tip that I have for y'all to help with your period cramps once again is dark chocolate. I also mentioned this in my first video. Being that the dark chocolate has antioxidants in it that help the hormone serotonin. The serotonin is the hormone that improves your mood. So that can help. Anybody that wants to be happy should eat more chocolate. Dark chocolate to be exact during your cycle or even before. Don't eat it in crazy amounts because then you're just going to feel guilty. But like, why am I eating this? Oh my goodness. So you know what I'm saying? Indulge in it here or there. And y'all let me know how that go for y'all. I did see in my comments in my previous video that some people are familiar with eating dark chocolate around that time of the month. And it helps them out. I may try it next month. I may. I don't know. It depends. <laughs> I hope y'all enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you smash the thumbs up. If this has helped you out in any way, make sure you smash the thumbs up. Share this video. And do not forget to subscribe and turn on your notifications. I love y'all so much. I will see y'all later this week with another video. I gotta think. I gotta think. I gotta think. Oh, yeah. By the way, y'all. I have been on like... Ooh, honey. Mm -mm. I have been on like this crazy, crazy water drinking thing where i haven't been drinking oh lord where i have been drinking like a ton of water you hear me like i've been drinking water day and night day and night kid cutty style you feel me so carnival is coming up and Baby, I need this body to be looking speak and spin. You feel me? I am making my own costume. So if y'all would like to see that in a video, make sure you tell me in the comments. Let me know on all my social medias. Just spam me like, yes, do not forget to make this outfit and film where you are making this outfit, where you got all the supplies. Okay, Carnival is in two weeks. It is October. It's the first weekend in October. So, exactly in two weeks, a big beat, and I am hype, okay? And these are still going to be in my hair because I think it's like real, it, it causes for these to still be in my hair, you feel me? I think it's very appropriate. So, if y'all would like to see me making my outfit, and if y'all would like for me to vlog while I'm attending Carnival, make sure y'all let me know, okay? I love y'all. Make sure y'all stick around, browse, and look at some other videos. If you have not checked out the How to Shorten Your Period video, make sure you check it out. I think it will help a lot of people. I got a lot of positive feedback on it. So, yeah. I will see y'all later. Happy Sunday. Y'all have a great day. Bye, y'all.